Elston Howard sends it grounded to Pee Wee Reese. And these Dodgers at last are world champions. Delirious with joy, teammates and fans mob the Brooklyn pitcher in wild acclaim. Now only Aparicio stands between the Dodgers and victory. Little Louie flies out to Wally Moon. The Dodgers win 9-3 and bring Los Angeles its first baseball world championship. The players swarm around Larry Sherry, outstanding hero of the series. It's a tap back past the mound to Marty Wills. He grabs it, throw to first, it's all over the Dodgers' win. The Dodgers win it. In the ninth inning, no run to the Yankees on one hit. One error and two runners are left on base. And the final score, the Dodgers two and the Yankees one. He did it. Sandy Kopax gets his tenth strikeout. His second consecutive shutout of the Twins on Monday on a four-hitter, today on a three-hitter. Every pitcher, of course, likes to finish a game with a strikeout. This was, of course, not a game. This was the seventh game of the World Series. Welch continues to throw in the Los Angeles bullpen. Watson hits it high in the air. For the center fielder, Ken Landro, this should do it. The Dodgers for the 1981 champions of baseball. Three and two to Tony Phillips. Lansford down the line from third with two out. Stein back on deck. Five two Dodgers in the ninth. Got him. They've done it. Like the 1969 Mets, it's the impossible dream revisited. Ownership, Andrew Friedman, Dave Roberts. That's strike three. Dodgers have won it all. 